Welcome, guys and gals, to maybe the last part of Fallout 2. Ah, toxins have been released into the air. The FEV virus is killing everyone here, and we gotta shut down a reactor. You see Tom Murray, the head of Atomic Energy Commission. That sounds like... What's the alarm ringing about? Don't panic, anyone? Don't panic? I guess I can't talk to him anymore? Huh. Okay. Maybe I can't talk to him because the alarm's going off. I just gotta find the reactor then. Can I use these computer consoles? No, it's... Same problem. Uh, there's this uh, mainframe. Can I hack the mainframe? No. How do I get in there, though? Uh... Maybe these computers have a use? I don't see any way to get into this... Oh! Those doors, right there. They're just sort of blended into the wall. Can I open these? There we go. Power plant machinery. Can I science this stuff? Fail to learn anything. Blowing up the mainframe was one of the options. Well, that's the mainframe. Where does this go? This elevator doesn't go anywhere? Alright, so these are computers. That's the reactor core. Well, I could quick save right there. And I do have... this bit of C4. Let's see what happens. Is that gonna work? No, that doesn't work. <laughs> Let's not waste it. So we can't blow that up. Suspension tank is there. I can't use these computers, they don't do anything. That's the reactor core. I mean, it seems like I'm supposed to blow that up. By the terminals? I can't use these. Those are computers. A large supercomputer, probably the fastest looking computer you've ever seen. Was there? There's just dead guys here. Don't need any of that. We could try... Blowing these up. Oh, you have destroyed the reactor. You gained 10,000 experience points. Fantastic. Nine minutes and 53 seconds to evacuate. <laughs> Good thing I quick saved. Does this elevator work? Because if this let us back up, that would be nice. No, it totally doesn't. Nine minutes and 41 seconds. Complete reactor meltdown. We gotta go. We gotta go. Let me just re-equip this. Okay, let's... Uh, Make sure I'm full health. And let's go. We gotta go up the long way. Blow up the reactor. Um, this way. I hope it doesn't take too long to get back out. Nine minutes and 26 seconds to evacuate.
There is no, in no way to open the door? Wait. Oh, okay. Maybe up this staircase. Oh, the blast doors open when it's an emergency. Okay, fantastic. Alright, so I'm just going to save here on a new save. Save game. Meltdown. All my companions are here. But so are those people in power armor? Oh. And he's there. Okay, um, can I get my companions back? What do you want? Let's go. You want me back now? Yes. Okay, they don't attack. Travel up, yes. Cassidy. What's up? Yeah. Let's go. Alright then. Let's head out. And Sulik. Sulik. What you be needing? Let's go. What you be needing? That's it for now. Okay, so I got my companions back. And I'll put another save here. Whatever. Marcus, get out of the way. Alright. So it seems like... We're facing off with that big guy. You see a Secret Service agent, Frank Horrigan. Oh, this is the Secret Service agent that they use the FEV virus on. Jared Ong, welcome to the stream. Darko Daria. Oh, great to have you. This might be the final fight. I don't know if these turrets are gonna shoot as well, but uh, I s I'm gonna save right here. Uh, under that. Yes, overwrite that. That's fine. Seven minutes and 44 seconds to evacuate. You've gotten a lot farther than you should have. But then you haven't met Frank Horgan either. Your ride's over, Muty. Time to die. Can't we talk this over? Oh, wait, wait. I should have talked to those people back there. <laughs> um, is there a way to... Making our reality. Uh, uh. I want to reload. How fast does he kill me anyway? Not too fast. I'm okay with that. Ten, six. Oh, he shoots three times though. All right. I didn't talk to all those people back there. Are these people anyone? Enclave troopers? Ah, this guy is actually. Halt. What are you doing here? Shouldn't he have said this when I first came back? Ah. I'm trying to get back to my people. Well, you know what, freak? Agent Horrigan just stormed past here. He's waiting for someone to try and make a break for it. Who's that? He's some genetically engineered freak is what he is. Used to be the president's bodyguard secret service agent Frank Horrigan. Now he's more than half machine. Sounds like bad news. Oh, that he is. And worse, he's going to mop the floor with you. He's tough, fast, and just plain mean. I've seen what he likes to do with mutants, and it ain't pretty. I'm not a mutant, and, uh, what did he do? I don't like to talk about it. It gives me nightmares. Let's just say that those walls aren't covered with rust, exactly. Sounds like I'm going to have a hard time getting past him. That's the understatement of the year. I pity you, pal. Really do. should be, feel bad for yourself. Your power plant's control computer got fried and now you're headed for a meltdown. You're all dead men in less. Oh yeah? Tell me another one. If the reactor's scragged, how come the lights are still on, huh, Smarty? Haha, <laughs> tell me another one. That's just the emergency lighting. Hey, I saw where your computer was. It's not broken, it's gone. I'm telling you, you're all going down for the count unless... Hey, we could actually convince him. Don't you tell a pretty story. You make me laugh. You know, I think you might even last over one minute mark with Horrigan. That'd be a new record. Good luck, Mudi. Gee, aren't you generous? I better warm up first. <laughs> no. I better hope you're, that your armor floats. Goodbye. I guess we couldn't convince him. All right. Now we can save.
let's uh, try to get our companions out in a nice angle. Everyone sort of group up here. All right. It seems like he doesn't use a burst fire weapon, so it's okay if we group up a little bit. There we go. Let's talk to Frank Horrigan. You've gone a lot farther than you should have, but then you haven't met Frank Horrigan either. Did I free he the? Rides over, Muty. Time to die. Did I free the people from the cells? The the cells. They said once I take out the reactor, they'll already be freed because the the laser walls will go down. Oh, so I can't get there because. Actually, I technically could have gotten there, but we're out of time. Um, actually, that's that's true. I could I could walk down there. I thought I couldn't because I thought he would talk to me. But let's uh, let's have a quick look. They should be gone. Wow, that was a critical hit. Oh wow, I'm actually gonna die. I died in one turn. Huh. Looks like I was going to reload anyway. Let's uh, have a look down these stairs. Are they freed? They're still here. Oh, damn it. All the... I forgot all my companions are with me. Damn it. This is so... Did I just die in a... <laughs> all right. I guess we gotta kill Frank Horrigan first anyway. Let's try not die here. You've gotten a lot farther than you should have. But then you haven't met Frank Horrigan. Can't we either. talk this over? We just did. Time for talking's over. Wait. Uh, I guess we can't convince him at all. Now let's see if we die immediately again. Don't crit, don't crit. Okay, we didn't crit. Uh, how many action points do I have? He has 999 hit points, wielding a end boss plasma gun <laughs> with 41 out of 50 shots microfusion cells. Alright, let's try... Wow, it's so hard to hit him in anything. I guess we should just uh, do normal shots then. He was hit for 57. If I turn my back on him, will I be okay? Uh, well. Oh, all the turrets fight as well? Oh wait, no, this is impossible. And those other power armor guys come in as wait, 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 wait. This is um. How do I do this? This is this is not the way to do it. <laughs> well, yeah, I have perished. I can't fight everything. Enter user ID. Yeah, I think I'm missing something. Maybe the president had something. Um, I was saving here before I sent the mainframe into meltdown, right? Like if I go back up. Can I close these doors? so that the noise doesn't escape. Because you guys were asking me to kill the president before, but... The doors are closed. He has 120 HP. I missed, damn it. 
so trying to kill the president activates everyone. Right, okay. So, not the best. I don't think I can take on all these people. So those doors aren't soundproof. Now, for the longest time, you guys have been telling me I could kill people with super stim packs. <laughs> is, that a, is that a thing we can do here? I'm gonna put a new save here. Now, let's name it properly. Prez. Now we could try, just have a look by, uh, um, Steel. We could check his inventory. There's nothing there. Maybe on this guy? Do we have to kill him to see it? I mean, I have super stim packs. I have four of them. I don't know how many it would take to... Like if I use all of them on him. And then I, like, rest for an hour? Or does it take longer than that? It's, uh... Maybe I need more super stims to actually kill him that way. Hmm. Need more stims, yeah. So I can't steal it off him. I can't fight this many people. What happens if I, uh... If I drop one of those, do they blame me for it? They blame me for it, right? Yeah, they blame me. Huh, if I can't figure this out in time, we're gonna have to go to part 41, which I can't do today. Ah, I was hoping I could finish the game, but it seems like it's a little more complicated than I expected. There's a computer console here. If I reverse pickpocket the C4? I could try, but my steel's not very high. Like, how do you reverse pocket something? Yeah, see? My he immediately finds me out. And that activates everyone, right? Yeah. Huh. I mean, I don't think I can take on everyone. Because there's, yeah, there's like a lot of guys with power armor.
There's no silent way of killing him, as far as I know. Try stealing, stealing from sneak mode? You plant the plastic explosives. That actually worked. But is it going to explode? Because I didn't set a time. Like, do you have to set a time and then pick it up and then put it back in his pocket? Yeah, you gotta arm it, right? How, how do you arm... Like, if I... Arm it like that... So it's now armed, right? If I sneak... Steal... Sorry, I've never done this before! <laughs> okay, it's armed. I said it for a minute, so that might take a while. Thought it would be a little... Actually, it would actually be fast if I just reload and set the time to be less. 30 seconds. Done. Sneak. Steal. Here. Plant that. Sneak again. Well, let's see if it works. No, he d uh, We still entered combat. And we can kill him. And I can't end combat. Do I actually have to kill everyone on this floor? I don't know if I can. I mean, I could try, but to single-handedly kill everyone. I just want to check his body. There is something. The presidential access key. That's what we need. Let's see if Vice President Bird has something as well. I'm still sneaking, I didn't realize. So Vice President Bird does not have anything. Well... How do I do against these things? <laughs> they have rocket launches. It's actually hitting me for no damage. That is a lot less effective than I thought it would be. But I am kind of being surrounded here. Like, do I have to kill all of these people? Ah. Oh. Like, these guys have 200 hit points. So those robots do no damage to me, basically. But, oh yeah, these guys totally destroy me. 
Oh yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> Those power armor dudes. Huh. And I can't steal it off him. I could try... Like, how many normal stim packs does it take to kill someone? Like, I was told normal stim packs would kill someone as well. That's two. That's three. That's four. That's five. That's six. That's seven. That's eight. That's nine. That's ten. That's eleven. That's twelve. That's thirteen. That's fourteen. That's fifteen. Would that do it? Four super stims and sixteen normal stims? I've used a lot of stim packs. <laughs> um, let's try wait. Rest for six hours. I guess that's not enough. Huh. Okay, so that's not gonna work. Any other ideas? Because I'm pretty sure I need that presidential pass key to log on to the computers. I don't think I can hack them. You see a functional computer. I never really explored this computer here. And there's a computer console. Welcome to Poseidonet. This terminal controls the operations of the MK-17 fusion bomb. Current status of bomb is deactivated. Activate the bomb. Activation of the bomb requires two forms of security overrides. Override 1, red reactor key card given only to top US research officials. Override 2, presidential security pass key given only to the president of the United States. Hmm. Let me try one thing. If I... If I arm these for a minute... Sneak, steal, and I leave. <laughs> well, the people down here aren't attacking. Let's see if they immediately start attacking. Actually, no, let's wait a minute. Let's actually wait a few minutes. Let's rest for 10 minutes. It didn't work. Did he take damage? He took damage! We found a way! <laughs> it just didn't kill him. Okay. Do I- I don't have any more explosives, right? I think there are some upstairs. Right? I, I think there was... There are some upstairs. 
Actually, that's, this way is faster. Unless there's some in the lockers around here. Were there any in these lockers by the entrance? Okay, we found a way. These didn't have any C4, did they? Ah, holding a gun slows everything down. There's no C4 there. I hate how you have to close lockers to open them again. So I basically just need one more explosive. Okay, we found a way. Oh, not this. Well, we can make it over here. Were there any explosives in here? There's ammo there. I didn't check that locker. That's a new one. None there. What are these? Oh, the Gek is here. Okay. This was all just ammo, right? Yeah, there, there wasn't any here. And making my way back through here is going to be a bit of a pain. I suppose... Maybe it just didn't do quite as much damage as it should have? Let's uh, try it one more time. So the last time he was left with... 7 hit points. Wait, what? Why, why did it explode immediately? Um, that's not good. I think because of my ineptitude. Okay, sneak. Steal. Done. Stop sneaking. Oh, I forgot to open the doors, damn it. Let's go. And leave the screen. Okay, so he was immediately hit there. It says there, 33, 48, 24. So we don't have to wait. But... It's just not quite enough damage. We need one more. Ah, none of these crates are... Supply crates, are they? Like, I could check these desks. But I doubt they keep C4 in desks. Oh, if only I knew. <laughs> yeah, the desks are empty. I'm gonna have to make my way through. I want to at least kill the president today. So I'm gonna have to make my way through this. So I have to reverse trial and error my way through. Oh, that worked. Just that one on the right. <laughs> I thought it would have taken longer. Okay, good. So, a bunch of people here died. You monster! Have you come to kill me too? <laughs> Chosen one, how did you get here? Careful. If you destroy the men, came yes, there, yes, yes. they brought us here. That is what they call it. You must... Okay, sorry, I accidentally... Click the wrong option. Now, the C4 was, um... Where's the way back up? Ah, oh, there it is. I remember there was a C4 up this way. 
Ah, the ending of Fallout 2 is... It's, it's so complicated. Okay, all these people are dead. As they slide off to the side. All these citizens are now dead. Now, I remember there was C4 in this uh, weapons room to the back. I just need a little bit more. Not grenades. Do grenades work? I'm not sure. Not ammo. There we go. Two extra C4. Mirkow76, welcome to the stream. Uh, I was hoping to finish Fallout 2 in this part, but um, it seems like the ending is a little bit more complicated than I anticipated. But I do want to kill the President of the United States within this episode. Don't take that out of context. <laughs> the President of the Enclave in this episode. Alright. We got the C4. Let's head on down. Took us a while to figure out how to kill him with the C4 without alerting people to us. I also do need one C4 to, to kill the computer, so I should not use all of them. Ah, now I've got to figure out how to... get back. No, oh, let's, um... was it this one? Nope, that trapped us in here. Come on, let us through. Almost? No? Come on, one of these open up. I hate this this maze. There must be a pattern I'm missing on, on these doors. Okay, that so no, that trapped me in this room. Damn it. So that opens there. None of these doors are open yet. Taking some damage. Try this one again. Yes, I got it. Maybe. <laughs> Let's see if this one opens this door. No. Gotta use a stim pack. Okay, got it. Yes. Let's head down. Now we get to kill the president. Ah, finally figured it out. We should also heal up. There we go. Let's uh, save right here. Okay, so we need to save one C4. So let's uh, set arm one, arm two, and then we'll arm the two dynamites. Let's hope None of them exploded. Sneak. Steal on the president. 
Damn it, he caught me. <laughs> of all the times to catch me. Okay. Let's just speed this along. We'll preemptively go into sneak. Save this under prez. Arm one. Arm two. Arm the dynamite. Arm the dynamite. We're gonna save right here. So now we can just straight away and steal. This is a little... Why, do, why does he detect me now? Like, before this, he never detected me. Ah, oh, damn it. Already sneaking. Okay, it worked. Let's run away. This should kill the president. There we go. President Richardson was hit for all that damage. And he's dead. And we get to loot his body. <laughs> Fantastic. Why is there a leftover plastic explosives? Is that armed? It's still ticking. Because it didn't kill him? Just to make sure that that's gone. Let's rest for 10 minutes right here. Okay, I didn't want that going off and then suddenly... Maybe that's a glitch. You see plastic explosives. Alright, well. Save game. Boom. We got the passkey. Now, another thing that we could try and figure out is uh, how to get the lights off because we couldn't convince that guy to help us with Frank Morrison. Power plant machinery. There's a terminal there I haven't tried to use before. I can't use that terminal? Like, all these terminals don't do anything. That's the reactor core. Like, I can't even interact with the mainframe. Let's try log on. Enter user ID. I think I better do this somewhere else. Why? Where, where else should I be doing this? Like that one? I have, um, I have the president's pass key. The access key has what looks like a presidential seal on it. It appears as though it's to gain presidential level access to computers. Okay. So these computers all tell me like I should I should do it somewhere else. I don't know why. Log on? Back? I can't log on. Oh, there's a bunch of lockers down here. Maybe C4 was down here. <laughs> um, okay. Well, I suppose... We can do this, as before. I destroyed the reactor. 
Does that set off the timer? Yeah, 9 minutes 49 seconds. Complete reactor meltdown. So we can head back up. See if we can use that computer upstairs at least. Have I thought about doing Fallout Tactics after finishing this? I have always considered it. I actually like Fallout Tactics. People seem to not like it so much. But I think gameplay-wise it's really good. It's just not as story-based. So, I'm just going to try one thing, and then i got to bring this stream to a close. Now that I have the presidential key, can I use this computer? Or is it just going to say, I think I better do this somewhere else? Log on? Yeah, why? Why, why can I not log on? It just says, I think I better do this somewhere else. Where else? Ah. Uh. Also, considering the reactor core meltdown is coming, these power... I'm not sure if I've actually saved my people. There is no way in which I can open these doors. <laughs> well, Dark Odair, welcome to the stream. But I have to bring it to a close. I thought I was going to finish on this part, it'll be a nice part 40, but turns out the ending's a little bit more complicated. Well, that's going to be it from me. Um, he killed the president, got his passkey, not too sure what to do from here. Um, maybe I shouldn't blow up the computer because I might not save our people, it locks the blast doors. We need to... Uh, Shut down the power first as well. Might help with convincing that other guy to help us. And we've got to shut down the turrets. i got to figure all this out. So I guess we're going to end on part 41. Uh, which I'm going to just finish off next weekend. And then maybe play more Obduction. Uh, that's going to be fun. But that's it from me for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. We're almost at the end of Fallout 2. And that's it for today. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!